that on. I'll make sure that's in focus. Okay, so. What is the definition of religion being a controversial and complicated subject that scholars in religious studies fail to agree on any one definition religion is defined as the belief in and or worship of a superhuman controlling power especially a personal god or gods to note i didn't mention spirituality in that definition the definition for spirituality is the recognition of a feeling or a sense or a belief that there is something greater than oneself something cosmic or divine in nature. Often, in discussion with the two topics, I found that many assume the two are more alike than they really are. It's like comparing the experience of looking at a map of the ocean to the experience of standing next to the ocean. So, I've sought out the assistance of a variety of incredible and insightful people to help me answer the question, is being spiritual the same as being religious? And if not, what is the difference? Can you please state your name, your religion if you have one, and your profession? My name is Stephen James Morrison. I'm the school chaplain here at Westbourne Grammar School, and I am a ordained Christian minister. Hi, my name is Sol. I am not religious, and I am a full-time student. So my name is Jigi Shapatel. I'm Hindu, and I'm in construction. Would you say you are a spiritual or religious person? Uh, yes, I would absolutely define myself as religious and spiritual. I grew up in a Christian family, so I went to Sunday school, went to youth group, and uh, I just say that I never left youth group. When I was 18, I became a youth leader, and then when I became, when I was 23, 24, I became an ordained youth minister. Yeah, pretty well my whole life grew up in a Christian church. I was Catholic from birth up until around year six, year seven. Then I kind of just dropped off and went with no religion and I still am not religious. I am spiritual, like I've always been spiritual, so maybe as old as I am. So, but I was never into that much to the traditions and the way people behave around the concepts of religion and God and everything. And I've always tried to understand this same concept from other perspective, which is why I think I was always spiritual, not so much of a religious person. At 13, I went to a youth group camp and we had this amazing speaker who really spoke about faith and all that sort of stuff. And, and I, I had been resisting and being a musician, I, I loved the music. So what we would call our worship music was just beautiful. And I always wanted to be able to engage with it on a more personal level. So I think at that camp when I was 13, that's when I made a decision, you know what, I'm gonna embrace faith for myself. Would you say you were more spiritual when you were still considering yourself under the Catholic religion or would you say you're more spiritual now? Definitely more spiritual now because the only reason I was a Catholic was because my parents wanted me to be and I always felt like I just didn't belong in that religion. Now that I'm kind of exploring spirituality on my own through witchcraft, I found I'm definitely much more spiritual because I'm kind of in control of what I get to do compared yeah. to when I was a Catholic. A lot of people think that spirituality and religion are the same thing, but personally, I believe that they are completely different. Um, different religions touch on different parts of spirituality. Like, it took me a while to find that this spirituality witchcraft thing works for me. Um, I agree that the two can go hand in hand, but I don't think they have to. Um, so there's a saying that says religion is man's attempt to get to God. But when I think spirituality is very different to that, I think it's a very deep personal journey and understanding of faith. And, and faith may be in God, as in we would know the Christian God, the God of the Bible. Um, it may be in nature, it may be yeah. in science, it may be in all sorts of things that we equate to God. So I think yeah. you can be incredibly spiritual, intuitive, yeah. um, mystical <laughs> in a spiritual realm yeah. without this religiosity. Well, religion is more about how people are looking at the existence of God and more about the traditions and what are the ways of following a 
particular religion but spirituality is about all those things because it, it it has nothing to do with any god it has nothing to do with any religion it it is just in general concept so do you have any advice for people um who seek guidance and stability but don't want to label their spiritual endeavors just be yourself yeah. understand what's happening around you experience what's happening with you yeah. stability is not something that you can find in books or you can learn from some kind of training or anything you have to achieve that on your own it's like your personal exercise if you want to like not label yourself definitely just find things you can do that make you feel relaxed content and the most yourself just researching anything that makes you feel good everyone's personal experiences um, affects how you view things if i was still a catholic person I feel I wouldn't have that stability that I have now. Everyone learns differently, everyone interprets and reflects on things differently, so what might work for me might not work for you or someone else. Labels prevent us from seeking, it prevents us from searching, and I think the search and the journey is beautiful. I wouldn't write religion off as a a killer of spirituality. Yeah. I think for a lot of people, they do need the scaffolding. It helps them, but for others, they don't. And it's yeah. such a personal thing. But I, I would say to anybody, what a what a what an exciting, inspiring endeavor yeah. to search. But while religion's on the decrease, I, I would my observation is I think spirituality is probably on the increase. Yeah. If we silence the noise and be prepared to go searching ourselves we might find things that are far beyond yeah. what we've been told. Being spiritual is something that happens by default. It's an outcome of your existence, whereas religion is something that happens when you put your spiritual reality to work. We are all spiritual beings having a human experience. Whatever you want to call it, Spirituality isn't a label that's too confining, unlike the doctorates and religious books that tell us how we should worship and who we should worship. Faith is key. One's relationship with the divine is a spiritual connection. It should be uniquely independent and a wonderful experience that ultimately you don't have to be religious to experience.